Hello friends, welcome. So in this video I'm going to work with the getters because I think in our store we have worked with state, also with the actions. So create state and actions and then in the views we have import the store, create a constant for movies store object and then use that the get is loading state and also to get single movie here or the same in the movies we get the movie store object and we call the get movies to get all the movies and then we access the loading is loading state and also we make a loop to the movies state good now let's work with the getters and if you go to the getters here in the pinya here we have examples for getters so getters are exactly the equivalent of computed values for the state of our store so here we have we have an example a getter like this get the state here and manipulate the state also we have an example here and return a number as you can see the return type must be explicitly set so we say number the return to make sure we return the number also accessing other getters so here we have double count and then we create another one and say return this double count plus one also we have here passing arguments the getters so we have the state here and also the argument which is this user id and in the template we say get user by id and add that argument which is true here good but in our case uh, i'm going to so let's go here in the store and first i'm going to create a getter to get the total count of movies and I'm going to display that here when we say movies in the header and the count how many movies we have so for that let's come here and let's say give it a name I'm going to name it total movies like this and we need to add the state as we so and here I'm going to say return the state and now access the movies array and get the length of movies that's it now because inside of the movies and let me remove this we don't need not that anymore so now here on the h1 when you say movies let me also add some classes i'm going to say text to excel font uh, i'm going to make semi bold and text indigo 700 or 600 okay and now here when you have movies i'm going to add parentheses and then inside here I'm going to display the gather we have here, the total movies. And we can display that by saying movies store and dot and the gather, which is the total movies, like this. Not in we don't call that, we just add the pointer and let's save. Come here and if I refresh, now we have movies and how many movies we have five so if i go here and refresh go to the movies now we have five movies okay so the first getter is here next i'm going to create another getter and let me do something like this so it's more nice for you i'm going to create another getter here i'm going to filter the movies so let's say here filter 
movies like this and I'm going to return so as you can see now this is as a function and I'm going to return this by saying something like this as a function we have access to this and say this dot movies now here we access by adding the state here we can because we this is as a function we have access to this and now we have this dot movies and i'm going to say dot filter i want to filter the movies and add a movie here and i want uh, i want to return i'm going to filter the movies by the year so if i open here in the db.json in the movie we have also the year as you can see and i want to filter them by year so i'm going to say return movie dot year and if that is greater or equal than some year for example let's say uh so we have 2019 18 16 14 and 2004 so we can say greater than 2010 here and we are going to get all except this one but i'm going to do so let's do something like this now and in the movies here when we make a loop so let's see we have five movies here as you can see we can say also uh, not make a loop in the movie store but make a loop to this filtered movies we created so say movies store filter movies like this and if i save now we have only four because in the filter we say return the movie year greater than 2010 uh, that's it okay but i'm going to do something else i'm going to say here uh, let's say a filter or a year I think is and I'm going to add 2000 here and then here I'm going to say this not something like this this dot year and now if I save come here and refresh we have five because initially this year is 2000 and in the movies what I'm going to do, I'm going to add a select here. So I'm going to add the select inside here and let's cut this one. Add a div with a class uh, flex or just margin. 2 and padding 2 and then I'm going to add another div here with class flex and uh, I'm going to add uh, inside here I'm going to add select input after this one I'm going to add what we had here so let's say first and let's see yeah we have something like this refresh everything works and also if I inspect the elements go to the console uh, clear this up and go back yeah everything works but now i want to add that select here and i have prepared and just i'm going to paste that in this div here i added a select with id select movies and some classes here and also options here with the value is 2000 2010 and 2020 so what i want to do i want to access the this year here and change when we check 
this select and then if we change that to 2010 this is going to be 2010 and here the filter is going to return the movies whether the year is greater than or equal to 2010 okay so in here now in the select we need to add the v model also v model and we're going to use this here so we v model movie store dot year like this save and if we save that come here uh, let me add in this flex margin bottom of uh, four yeah like this and right now as you can see we have uh, five movies if i select over 2010 we have only four because in the db.json this one is 2004 so is not greater than 2010 what we have selected in here and also if we select 2020 we don't have any movie with choose how greater or equal than 2020 i think yeah so let's come here and let's say 2020 we don't have any but if i change this to be 2020 like this and let's save and if i refresh select now 2020 we have this one and let's inspect the element to see the console everything works correctly go back go to the movies select all okay select over 2010 and select over 2020 okay now one more thing if you like if you don't like no problem as you can see right now we have one movie here because we choose this uh, select here but the movies right is saying here we have five movies which we have in the total if you don't like to add the total but just how many movies we have over 2020 for example or here over 2010 and want to update also this one we can do that you can see here we have also the the getters accessing other getters here we have an example with this and we access the getter like this we can say also here instead of returning the total movies we say return but let's make this uh, function and let's say return this dot filter movies dot length and let's save go up here and refresh right now we have five movies if i select 2010 we have four movies and if i select over 2020 we have only one movie here okay that's it about the gutters and i think we have all covered so the state getters and the actions also we have plugins here but this is for more advanced so i'm not going to show you that i show you also how we can add the router inside the mind.js we just added pina use store and store router and we can use in the store by saying this dot router push okay i think we are okay now this is our store movies with the state with getters and the getter will access another getter and with some actions i hope you enjoy friends and if you like don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video and see you in the other tutorials all the best